exactly who you are. You don't have to change. You don't have to pretend to be anybody that you're not. You just get to be exactly who God created you to be. And I'm going to talk to you today, and we're going to kick this thing off with how in the world do you do that? And how many of you watch those things come true over your life? Because you said them. So first, we're going to change the way we speak. And when you catch yourself saying something that does not align with the intentions that you set for the things that you want, you're going to say, delete. How many of you been sitting in my house and heard me audibly shout, delete, delete? Nope, we don't think like that anymore, Tina Joy Carol, delete. I've done it this weekend here in this event. If you don't think those old nasty thoughts are going to come back to try to haunt you and taunt you and get you, talk you out of going after your dream, you are mistaken. The only person that can control what's going on up here is you. Yeah. You've got to use language that supports what you People want. People have already got the blue diamond. I know what I want. I know the work I'm willing to do to do it. What is it you want? Say it. I am so happy and grateful that. And then say it. Next, create a line. It's, you're going to feel so out of place. It's going to feel so out of character for you to take the action. But on the other side of the action is where you change. On the other side of the action is where you change people's lives. Friends, no matter what's going on in your life, these are the things that you're going to do every single day to make the goals and dreams that you have happen. This is an app that I use. It's called Think Up. You can screenshot there, take a picture of it. Go get the app. I think you have to pay for it. It's worth the investment. You put in your own happy and grateful statements. This is literally not even an eighth of, maybe not even a sixteenth of mine. And here's what's cool. I type them out and I record them. I'm so happy and grateful that my body is toned and you can see muscle without me flexing. I'm so happy and grateful to have a home at Golden Oak in Walt Disney World, Florida. I'm so happy and grateful that Tristan and Maddie go to church and serve in ministry. I'm so happy and grateful to attract leaders who build blue diamond businesses with me. I'm so happy and grateful to be Trillot's first presidential blue diamond. I'm so happy and grateful that I have 100 new emeralds in my organization. I'm so happy and grateful that I'm a blue diamond and Donnie's a red diamond. I'm so happy and grateful that I own a beach house on the water with a bunk room for the grandkids. What do you freaking want? Woo! What do you want? Do you even know what you want? And then you're going to start thinking of more things you want and you're going to add them. And here's the best part. I play it every morning and it's my voice. Repeating back to me everything that I want. I just play it while I'm getting ready. And you know what happens? They come true. Every one of them are coming true. Why? Because you attract what you say. If you don't think your words are powerful, watch what you say come true. Good or bad. Yep. I promise you, friends, it's from the words that you say. Smooth ride. All the way to the top, my friend, you are going to be disappointed. Mm -hmm. It is in the setbacks, it is in the valleys, it is in the hard days, when you're not sure why you're even doing it, that you grow the most, that your character is formed, that the woman or man that you need to become to attract the rank and the check that you want is built in those moments. And so you need to think, oh, this sucks, man, it's gonna be good when I come out. <laughs> Right? I need you to have that. I need yeah. you to get happy about that. Woo! Y'all sitting out there acting like y'all ain't had no struggles. So let me tell you about this girl. Still in mouse ears. To, I stopped weighing myself at 240 pounds, so I don't really know how much I weighed there. But I set an intention. I'll never forget. This was when I was, I was a multiple six-figure earner at this point, and I'm probably not supposed to say that. I don't know. But I remember looking at the successful people and thinking, 
They don't, they're not smoking cigarettes. They're not eating and healthy. They're getting to a gym. How they do one thing is how they do all things. Mm -hmm. And so, she was born. Woo! If this is your first event, I want you to stand up. Thank you, and everyone now, please welcome to the stage. 